Good evening, everybody. We'll begin with high school football, where it's been a dramatic week at Fort Dorchester with the news of Steve LaPrade's resignation as the head football coach and athletic director. This afternoon, LaPrade finally breaking his silence in a video sent out by LG Productions, who have handled his coach's show for years. LaPrade talked about what led to his decision. The former coach going into a, talking about a recording that was taken of him in the locker room talking about his players transferring to another school in the county. In today's video, LaPrade says things in the sport right now are like the wild, wild west as he talks about other schools going after Fort players. That locker room recording included LaPrad using profane language and disparaging remarks about coaches from another school. The coach talked about that in today's video. Obviously, you know my passion for my program, for my kids, for my school. Um, led me to say some probably unkind things, some things I probably shouldn't have said. I use profanity. If my mom was still alive, she would probably wash my mouth out with soap. Bless her heart and probably deserve it. Uh, sorry, mom. Um, unfortunately, these things happen. I'm not saying it's right, but that's a place that is sacred to me. That's a place that I feel like I can talk to my kids, my players, my coaches. Also today, Dorchester District 2 officially listing the job openings at Ford on their website, but the positions of head football coach and athletic director are separate, meaning two different people will hold those jobs going forward. There's also been a petition started online to bring LaPrade back to Fort Dorchester. Currently, it has more than 900 signatures. 